The unfortunate bit is people take science as a tough subject. But then the good thing is that's where you get a lot of solutions. Yeah? Because the mind is uh, left to explore, innovate and be as creative as you can. But not for nothing, but to come up with solutions which makes a difference. happy to see brilliant young scientists from various institutions in Malawi at this second edition of the Africa Science Week, both here in Malawi and the entire continent of Africa, and the first of its kind here at Chancellor College. My name is Alex Yenda. Here I'm exhibiting solar assembled locally in a home for community day secondary schools. The intention is to capture solar electricity and use it for community day secondary schools which have no electricity because that is clean in terms of destroying the atmosphere. So it can be used to store medicine yeah, in those rural areas with no electricity. Oh, yeah, you know, it's the yeah. medicine there, it's to hold, yes. then it gets defective. But then with this fridge, it's so easy to store the medicine. There are some things that you know can be done at uh, country level. Like if you talk about incubators, for example, I think for the most part we've been in importing incubators. But this yeah. is not a complex thing. Our participation here is also trying to show that these are things that can be done by students as well, and we can must produce these things at, at national level. For for education, for example, you could have virtual laboratory. So maybe in schools that don't have the capacity for actual physical labs, we could uh, simulate those in here. People can do experiments in here. Or for example, you can have simulated surgery, right? So people who are training in surgery, you know, they could do their training within this virtual environment. So I mean, the, the applications are limitless, really. 